actually this Mr. X reads so many things. It means they reads, uh, he reads uh, newspapers, magazines, novels, other books. So in a whole day, he devotes 7, 3 by 4 hours to the reading. If he devotes 7, 3 by 4 hours to reading, what he does, he devotes actually to 1 by 3 hours to a novel how much time he devotes to other books. He eats so many things and uh, in a whole day, 7, 3 by hour, 4 hours he read, then 2, 1 by 3 hours he devotes to one novel. So now the remaining time what he devotes to the other books. We say he reads for Seven three by four hours. Reads novel for two one by three hours. It means the remaining time he will give to the other books. It means Time for other books. Total time minus time to the novel will give you the time for other books. So we have a simple subtraction question here. Let's do it. We'll make them like fractions. These are the like fractions. Here, this is converted to 93 by 12. This is converted to 28 by 12. Now, 12 will be in the numerator, or sorry, denominator. And for bottom, 65. So 65 by 12, it is lowest? No. So let's convert it. So here we can write it as 5, 5 by 12 hours. So he devotes 5 hours and 5 by 12 part of one more hour. This time he devotes to other books. So completely he reads seven hours, three seven hours and three by four more hours. This is the complete time he devotes to the reading time, reading things. And then he is devoting this much time to the novel. So for other books, we what we will do from the total time, a novel time, subtraction, and we have the answer. Uh, next question says, find perimeter of a rectangular farm thirteen 